Hello and welcome to Print Edition. Today is the 157th birth anniversary of Sigmund Freud, the founder of psychoanalysis. Freud is one of those great thinkers who managed to leave his mark across several disciplines, though he is now most avidly read by students of literature, and for a good reason too. Much of Freud's writings are best enjoyed as literature, and for me, he is as important a literary figure as, say, Shakespeare. Having spent most of his life in Vienna, Freud fled to London in the wake of the Nazi persecution and died there. Today I'm going to read out to you the opening stanzas of W. H. Auden's Tribute to Freud, a poem that captures the essence of the rich life he lived. When there are so many, we shall have to mourn. When grief has been made so public and exposed to the critique of a whole epoch, the frailty of our conscience and anguish, of whom shall we speak? For every day they die among us, those who were doing us some good, who knew it was never enough, but hoped to improve a little by living. Such was this doctor. Still at eighty, he wished to think of our life from whose unruliness so many plausible young futures, with threats or flattery, ask obedience. But his wish was denied him. He closed his eyes upon that last picture, common to us all, of problems like relatives gathered, puzzled and jealous about our dying. For about him, till the very end, were still those he had studied, the fauna of the night, and shades that still waited to enter the bright circle of his recognition, turned elsewhere with their disappointment as he was taken away from his life interest to go back to the earth in London, an important Jew who died in exile. Thank you.